The Prime Minister, accompanied by the top leadership of Ochodonjupa, Governor James Werikwa, and Regional Chairperson Marin Bakera, visited Carfall Settlement, where only about 100 inhabitants are employed out of a total of 4,000. A small group of women have started a sewing project, recently adding laundry to their services until the old washing machine they used stopped working. To assist them in continuing to be productive, Kuvongelwa Amadila donated a new washing machine and three ironing boards to the project. Kuvongelwa Amadila also visited the oxidation pond, which is about to overflow, where she applauded the councillors for putting up a boundary wall. That development followed after at least six minors drowned in that pond. The visit to the Oshivarongo State Hospital had numerous complaints raised by the superintendent of the hospital from the dilapidated state of the hospital building to a lack of space to accommodate patients and a faulty air conditioning system. Premier acknowledged that those in leadership have a lot of ground to cover in providing residents with critical services. We need to have performance contracts that are based on strategic plans. These uh, contracts must have performance benchmarks performance targets that that must be aspired uh, towards and uh, there must be a review process to assess the progress that we are making to achieve our performance targets. Where we find that we have not been able to achieve these targets, we need to understand the reasons and we need to undertake interventions in order to rectify the situation. She urged the local authority to be mindful of what they want to achieve and to assess their performance based on that. Evelyn Polis, NBC News, Oshawa Rongo.